Okay. All right, here, what's new in the world of music? You know, all my life I've, I've heard about it, I've, I've watched movies about it, uh, I've written songs, and I've even sang songs about it. But hey, now that I met you, now I know for sure. Huh, what we got going here? Sounds like some new soul. This is some 1960s shit right here, but it seems to be new. It sounds very vintage, but almost too vintage. To be real, it's real. I think it's. I think it's new. Or am I tripping? Is this from the 60s? Yeah. I mean, I know the video isn't, but. You never know what trickery is going on. Oh, don't do that. Oh, no. I hope you know that guy. I like the drums and bass. Nice in the mix. Bass is pretty high up in the mix. I have no idea who this is. It's more than the love that we make. I almost feel like this has got to be a British band or a British singer. Or shall I say English? It's the many million ways in which you show me that you care. We don't do this in America anymore, do we? Are we doing this? Girl, you make me feel like a man. We don't have cobblestones in America anymore. You make my this heart grow deep within. Yes, you do, and that's why I wear my heart on my sleeve. And they have no helmet laws. As as you, hard Are there helmet laws in England? You know, sometimes we have to we have to ask ourselves, what are we willing to sacrifice for love? Is it fame? Is it fortune? Oh, nice horns. Uh, that remind me of something. Because love is just so much greater than all those things. It's quite an upbeat song for a down lyric. Never give a man a light who's carrying flowers. You are what love looks like. You are what love looks like. You are what love looks like to me. This is pretty authentic soul music, I can tell you that much. There was a time when this was really in music. Now it's an exception. You, girl. I love only you, girl. You're the greatest thing I've ever done. The greatest thing I've ever seen. I love only you. It really does sound old. Let me say it again. I love you. Please don't leave me. I love you. That's a nice fade. Yeah, not bad. Now, who is that? What is that? What's going on there? Explain to me the reality of this recording. Thomas Urich no. is the biography. Man. All right. Listen up, Tom. No. Tom. What? I'm just saying, the biography, Ignore the band's me. name is bigger than the whole article. Okay. Carlton Jumi... Jimmy Smith. No. I need some glasses. Carlton Jamel Smith. Nickname since the 90s has been Soul Brother Number New. Thanks to his cinematic portrayal of James Brown in Barry Levinson's Liberty Heights. I don't know what that is. I never saw that. Uh, okay, so he played James Brown. He has that timber to his voice. Or is it timbre? Been on Broadway. Played opposite Cindy Lauper. Garth Hudson. Garth Hudson? 
from the band Garth Hudson. All right. Smith grew up in the 60s and 70s. So did I. Influenced by Brown, Al Green, and any other musician with a color in their name. Bobby Womack and the Temptations. Where's he from? It doesn't even say, does it? Born in Harlem, it says. Born in Harlem? That was English. Don't tell me that's Harlem. I don't believe it. These words are small. So this is new. 2019? Wow, it's so out of the ordinary for what's going on in the music industry right now. Did you like it? Yeah, definitely liked it. It was kicking. It was good. True soul music. But I thought it was English. So excuse me. All right. Well, thank you. That was good. Why did you think it was English? Uh, I just didn't think they were doing that in America. And I don't hear that in America. That doesn't sound like something that's American product these days. It just... It was classier. It had a more taste. More. It was. It was just better. It didn't sound like you know. Just. It just didn't sound like the typical mainstream crap that you hear. All right. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm.